Hey, good morning, everybody. It is November 2nd, 2022 in Big Bear Lake, California. And the weather has just begun about 10 minutes ago. But it's not quite snowing. But it says it's snowing, but it's not. So, kind of sucks. Not snowing. It's, uh, here's what everything looks like right now. 38 degrees outside. It's 7 in the morning. But I'm hopeful we'll get a, a couple of snowflakes mixing in. Because it, 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 it even just told me, hey, the snow's supposed to start picking up. <laughs> you lie. So it's, we're not going to need much elevation difference to get a little bit of snow right now. And it was crazy because the uh, forecast changed like all night long, just constantly changing. It got to a point where it said we're not going to get anything this morning, and then we, we'll start getting snow tonight at 4 p.m. or this afternoon at 4 p.m. And then like three minutes later, it said, okay, now we'll have like 20 minutes of snow at 10 a.m. And so I didn't have, I turned off all my alarms, but I naturally woke up how I do um, when we have snow. And we didn't have any snow. Oh, you, you stupid light, come on. Let me show you what I'm seeing on my Weather Channel app. Look, look what this says. And it says right now this is happening. All right, we gotta go. So because it's 38 right now and we're getting really close to the snowfall, I just wanted to just go up to the Snow Summit and see if there's anything going on up there. I'll bet at the top of Snow Summit they're getting a little bit of snow. This would be like the coldest part of the morning anyway. Yeah, nothing. The thing just told me to keep my eyes on the road because I'm looking over at Snow Summit. Why don't you keep your eyes on the road, Mr. Subaru? Look at this bad boy. Super excited. Super nice ride. Thirty-seven degrees. You know what? We're gonna have to drive into Upper Moon Ridge. I didn't want to without snow tires just in case, but we're gonna do that. We are going to do that. So we can literally be up for the very first snowflake if we're lucky. We're gonna turn down Brownie Lane instead of going to Big Bear Boulevard. Big Bear Boulevard is straight up here where that white car is parked on the left.
got up, I'm like, oh my gosh. Because it looked like snow out there. And then when I went down, it was like warm. I mean, warm compared to what you would expect if it's snowing. But it can snow in, at, at, at 37 degrees. It doesn't have to be freezing. Just the air loft has to be colder so we can at least get some, some snow. And that happens a lot here. Sometimes it'll be 39 degrees, 40 degrees, and we'll get a little bit of snow. My baby is out in her first weather. My Subaru. Hey, my Subaru. Hey, Subaru. Brand new windshield with the brand new windshield wipers. Oh, yeah. So let's head up there. We would have gone around to the other side of town and done things like that right now, but we're, we're trying to find the snow right now. We could go up to Onyx Summit. They'll definitely have, have something going on up there. Oh, we tried that last time. I mean, it would definitely be something, but on the radar, it didn't look like there was really anything down that way at all. So we're gonna go to the top of Upper Moon Ridge. It'll probably get down to maybe 35 up there if we're lucky. But it'll be closer to a chance of snow. Snowplows are waiting. Snowplow and the <clears throat> truck that drops all the, the gravel and salt and stuff like that. If they still use salt, I don't even know if they do. I heard that they don't use salt as much anymore. eyes on the road. I'm just looking at this guy so I don't hit him. My car is telling me to keep my eyes on the road. Roads may be icy it says. So look that that new thing just popped up. My car doesn't do that. That orange thing. And then it said roads may be icy right above. That's pretty cool. We definitely don't have any use for X mode right now, but I have a feeling we'll be using X mode more in this vehicle than we did my other vehicle. Still 37. Once it gets down to 36, I'll tell you guys and so forth and so on. Because we are going to be cutting it close up here. 
it will at least get down to 36. We just gotta kinda hurry because the sun's about to start making its presence. We got 143 miles on this car now. Wow, when I looked out the window, all the roofs looked white, but maybe that's because I woke up and looked outside real quickly. And I was still asleep. <sighs> We're pretty much in the upper part of Moon Ridge, so it's still, still 37. Shit drop, though. Because we climbed high enough, I think, for at least to drop one degree. We're still climbing a little bit. I'm keeping my eyes on the road. So it was worth a shot to come up here. It was. to do moon loaf until I get my other car back because it's got a it's higher off the ground because I put a lift on it moon loaf is a little area that connects moon ridge and sugar loaf but a bit in the back areas like from up here actually You know what, once we get down here to the end, we're gonna turn right and go down that way. <clears throat> yeah, it's still 37, unfortunately. Calusa. Because I looked out, oh yeah, okay. I, I, I can understand what it's talking smack about. All right, let's turn right here. So we are on the upper part of Moon Ridge. Let's see if you guys can all, can at all see the, the mountain over here to the left. I'm keeping my eye on the road, don't worry, I'm just pointing the camera out there. You can't really see much over there, except the houses. Not that street, Calusa, we are on Calusa. So this is gonna take us down to Sheephorn. Well, it's gonna take us down to another street first, but then it'll take us to Sheephorn. Icy, but they won't be. <coughs> We're 
roads are definitely wet. So upload this and then left up here this whole this huge ditch area is where I, I tell you guys to go sledding also to bring your kids because they can sled at the top and go pretty fast down to the bottom and then they'll start heading up the other side you don't have to worry about being in the street or anything like that or worried be worried about your kids getting hit yeah it's just right over here and that huge gully thing goes through this whole area It's so close, you guys. It is so close to our first snow. So the rain wasn't in the forecast at all. Last night, it changed super late at night to, to say that last night it could get a few little drops of rain. I mean, it's, yeah, it's... Man, I'm glad I woke up randomly. No, it's not snow. It's still something. And when it's raining at 37 degrees, that really sucks. Because it's really cold. want to go to Bear, it's that way. Bear Mountain. Look, there's a couple coyotes right here. Let's uh, follow them. Hey guys, hey, what are you doing? Where's your buddy going? Where's your buddy going? Come on, come here. Oh, there's three of them. Oh, they ran to the back there. The one behind me <clears throat> still sketched out that I'm right here. I shouldn't have broken them up like that. That wasn't nice. They had their cameras out too. It says it's supposed to start, or well, that it's snowing right now, so obviously it's not snowing, is it? We've been to the highest points in the town. Some of you sent me pictures and stuff like that of what's going on up in Mammoth and Tahoe yesterday during the day, and it looked beautiful up there. back on Moon Ridge Road. If it was snowing, this would be a pretty decent snow right now for us. It's just raining pretty good. I'm telling you guys, like, when it's this cold and it's raining, it's awful it's miserable especially if you have to go outside for any reason getting soaked but with cold rain it's like jumping into a pool that's 
just above freezing. It's, it's horrible. You wouldn't want to do that. Unless you got those crazy people who do that Arctic plunge thing. But I guess if it's to raise money, you might as well put yourself through a little bit of suffering to help others. I don't see a problem with that. It looks like the sky's getting kind of blue over there. Can you guys see that? Oh, this is such a smooth ride. Wow. Like, really smooth. Oops, we gotta hold up for dude right here. 20 minutes. Yeah, it's blue skies kind of over there. Once it starts snowing, we'll go do, we'll obviously drive over to Baldwin also and just check everything out. All right, guys, well, that's all we got for right now. We got some rain. Anyway, I will upload this and then I'll talk to you guys soon once we, once we get some snow. Cheers. Peace out.